don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to never miss our new videos. A day at the observatory. And beyond. <laughs> Do you see that weird little circular structure in the middle of the mountain? It looks like a ball. Well, it's an observatory. And watch what's going to happen now. <gasps> it's opening! That's right, Leo. It opens because inside, there is a very powerful telescope that is used to observe the sky and the stars with incredible precision. Wow! Are you ready to find out what you can see through this telescope? How about you, Leo? Always super ready. Then let's see. This huge ball of fire is the sun, the closest star to our planet. What do you think about us looking at it in more detail? Do you see those flashes? They're solar flares. That looks hot. It is. The surface temperature is about 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Now let's move on to a cooler place. The moon. The moon is Earth's only natural satellite, which means that it revolves around it. This is what its surface looks like up close. Do you see those different sized holes? They're craters produced by meteorite impacts. Can we see other planets? That's a great idea. This is... Mars! <laughs> yes, Leo, the red planet. Do you know which one this is? Uh, Jupiter? <laughs> you were close. This is Saturn, with its famous rings. And if we get close enough, we'll discover that they're made of ice, dust, and space rocks. Wow! But there aren't only observatories in our planet. There are also some in space. This is the International Space Station. Astronauts from different countries live here. And this is what our planet looks like from up there. Super! And here ends our tour of observatories. On this tour, we found out what the sun, moon, and some planets look like up close. And we ended by observing our own planet, Earth, from space. What was your favorite part? What about you, Leo? Jupiter! I mean Saturn! <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. We'll see you on the next adventure. Goodbye!